Greetings, here we are again. One of TLC's most popular shows was 19 Kids and Counting, which ran from 2008 to 2015. The show followed Jim, Bob and Michelle of the Duggar clan as they raised what was at first 17 kids until it grew to 19, forcing the show's title to change. The parents have a reputation for making their kids adhere to strict rules since they're born, which largely stems from their Christian faith. It also seems that between their sons and daughters, the latter have it much harder. They have a total of nine daughters, from oldest to youngest, Jenna, Jill, Jessa, Ginger, Joanna, Johanna, Jennifer, Jordan Grace and Josie. Even though they're different ages, they've all grown up in the same household under their parents' strict rules. Many of the rules their daughters have to follow, some even as adults, are so severe they'll shock viewers. 20. Can't use birth control Birth control serves many beneficial purposes for women today. The doggers, though, aren't keen on it and want their daughters to stay away from it. According to Cheat Sheet, the family considers it a major no-no. The same source notes that using it doesn't line up with their religion and with what they believe in. 19. Can't get their own social media accounts When Duggars get married, they don't have to worry about following this rule anymore. Yet, according to the Hollywood gossip, until they officially tie the knot, they can't have their own social media accounts. Until then, they have to accept that their parents want to protect them from online dangers. 18. Can't wear pants It's typical for parents to bar their kids from wearing clothes they deem improper. The Duggars' perimeters for what's appropriate, though, are surprising. According to Cheat Sheet, the women aren't allowed to wear pants. That means the daughters have to wear long skirts and dresses, which really limits their options. 17. Have to be ready to satisfy hobby at any time Of all the roles the Duggars follow, this is one of the more uncomfortable ones. Michelle, the Duggars' matriarch, said, Anyone can fix and lunch, but only one person can meet that physical need of love. If that wasn't exactly clear enough, she elaborates further, you always need to be available when he calls. 16. Parents are on their text threads Here's one of the more extreme rules many people would have trouble adopting themselves. E! News reports that the dog or daughters carbon copy their parents on text messages. Their age isn't even a factor. That way, Jim, Bob and Michelle can keep tabs on what their daughters are texting and receiving. 15. No tattoos Tattoos today are all the rage. According to Pew Research Center, 4 in 10 have a tattoo. That doesn't matter to the Duggar parents, though, who don't want their daughters getting tattoos. Even Cheat Sheet reports, next to premarital sex, this is one of the worst offenses a Duggar can commit, which emphasizes just how unacceptable they think it is. 14. They monitor their kids' TV viewing. Many parents fear their kids will become couch potatoes who watch TV all day. According to Cheat Sheet, the Duggars limit the amount of TV their kids can watch. Yet, if there are one or two shows they probably make an exception for, it has to be reruns of 19 Kids and Counting or episodes of Counting On. 13. Can't read romance novels Thanks to Outlander and Fifty Shades of Grey, romance novels have had a resurgence as of late. It's a hobby the Duggars won't be taking part in, however. According to E! News, since romance novels conflict with the messages in the Bible, which the Duggars follow, it conflicts with their beliefs. 12. No Santa Claus on Christmas Christmas is an important holiday for Christians. Yet, if there's one aspect of the popular holiday the Duggars could live without, it's Santa Claus. While many can't picture Christmas without Santa, Cheat Sheet reports that he isn't a part of their festivities. This is so they can focus more on Jesus instead of old Saint Nick. 11. No front-facing hugs Even the Duggars have rules when it comes to how their daughters hug. To them, it's another danger zone that can get out of hand. To keep from going into dangerous territory, the Duggars teach side hugging as opposed to front-facing. That's at least what they want their daughters to follow until they say I do. 10. No secular music allowed To the Duggars, there are only two types of music, religious or non-religious. They only let their kids listen to one type. Any guesses as to which one it is? Cheat Sheet reports that they ban all non-religious music at home. That's not the only music-related activity they prohibit, though. 9. They prohibit dancing 
The Duggars don't want their daughters to bust a move. As touched upon earlier, while they allow their daughters to listen to religious music, they don't let them dance under any circumstances. Their parents fear it could tempt their kids into doing other activities. Which brings us to our next point. 8. Can't have intimate relations before marriage. When it comes to having sex, the Duggar parents strongly believe in waiting to tie the knot. According to In Touch Weekly, they teach their daughters to wait until marriage before having any intercourse whatsoever. This may seem extreme to some, but it's all part of their strongly held Christian beliefs. 7. Parents tag along on dates. There's nothing teens want more than to get away from their family and hang out with their crush. Unfortunately for the Duggar girls, they never get a chance to. According to E! News, their parents would tag along. Their father Jim Bob said that chaperoning keeps things from going in the wrong direction. 6. They're homeschooled and homeschool their own kids. The Duggars have a formula they appear to follow when it comes to raising their kids. Regarding their education, Cheat Sheet reports that Jim Bob and Michelle choose to homeschool their kids. It's a rule that even passes on to the daughters when they become parents themselves and in turn homeschool their own children. 5. Halloween is a no-go People love Halloween. It's the only time all year you can dress up in a costume and go door-to-door -door asking strangers for candy. And the best part is they'll give it to you. The Duggars don't know about the joys of Halloween, though. E! News reports that it's not a holiday that fits with their beliefs. 4. No body piercing The Duggar parents want to keep their kids from changing their bodies. That includes piercings. Cheat Sheet reports that Jim, Bob and Mary aren't too fond of their kids getting any body piercings. Yet In Touch Weekly reports that Ginger, Jill and Jessa all have piercings, so either the parents have eased up on this rule or else they're rebelling. 3. No alcohol Drinking alcohol is taboo for the Duggars. While it's legal in the United States to start drinking at age 21, their daughters learn to live without it. E! News even cites a time when both Jill and Jessa drank alcoholic punch by accident and called it disgusting. It's just another forbidden fruit they abstain from. 2. Have to be Baptist The Duggars raise their kids up in Christianity. According to Cheat Sheet, they follow a specific branch of Protestantism and call themselves Independent Baptists. That's the driving force behind many of the strict rules they have for their kids. The same source reports that their family isn't even the largest one at the church they attend. 1. Can't go to the beach Even though the beach is where people love to spend their summers, the Duggars have to find different plans each year. They seem concerned over guys ogling their daughters at the beach. It's just too hard for the guys to try and keep their eyes averted, shared Michelle, as per quote provided by E! News.